Well, there's a new penalty system, or a no penalty system. Quite a lot of the top YouTubers have been asking for this for a while. They don't like picking up the small, no one likes picking up small penalties for small offenses, little taps. Uh, so it looks like the penalty system is off. Others have expressed their concern that without the penalty system on, people won't have the incentive to drive fairly. Let's have a look at this race, see what happens. Starting in pole, I've already dropped a few places there. Just one, actually. It looks like fairly ordinary kind of bumping and bashing in what's a very difficult combination. I take a tap there and it fires me into first. As we come here, HH Goldie taps, drives past. Now, I wasn't aware the penalty system was quite as off as it was at this point and thought, oh, I'll go carefully through this next corner. Everyone else, however, I think knew the penalty system was off and uh, committed hard to the corner. So I dropped into midfield in a race of 10. But nothing horrendous going on, really. Big breaking point. And then I get shoved wide and drop into 8th position so 1st to 8th not particularly satisfying I'm not far away from the pack though the race isn't over if I can get a decent run down the straight who knows what could happen So I try and get a decent run, which I sort of fail to without taking an imaginative line. There's my imaginative line. Rather than the lift off and stay on the track, as long as you're not going to go super wide, you can keep your foot in. And I make a couple of places down the straight. Into the next big braking zone. Actually, some good racing now. This guy's trying the outside. I give him his car's width. We both get out safely. And then I end up on the outside here. I really don't want to be on the outside here. I try and break a little bit early and cut behind, but I fail to do that. HH Goldie comes past again, unconcerned to unbalance me and push me off the track. Let's whiz forward. I end up catching up with him again, and I think if I get good run out, even though we've both got half second penalties, I might be able to get a few more places down the straight. I take my imaginative wide line, cut to the inside. I've got the run, and he just drives into me twice. And having slid down the barrier he presses on undaunted this is foul play of the most obvious sort completely unpunished off we go into the next braking zone I can't quite remember what happens next ah oh, yes someone gets the braking wrong flies down the inside I spot them coming let them past and whiz forward again. I get this completely wrong. Lose where I am on the track. Outbreak myself. Make the race hard for myself. But at least I didn't hit anyone. I'm now down in the bargain basement. Blitz Ralp just aims for my passenger door, shoves me wide. Managed to catch up again. These two are having a real old go at each other. So I decide to back off and try and take the places if they happen to smash each other up, which they do. Coming round in eighth. I know he's got a penalty. I leave him the, the space. And we press on from there. Now I'm about to make a really irritating and foolish mistake. 
uh, which leads me to spin and bounce, well, almost spin, but drop really into 10th. And at this point, I just thought, I wonder how, how bad the penalty system is. I will commit, I thought to myself, the worst, most penalised possible penalty I could do, if that's even a sentence. But that's what it looked like. And I got no penalty for that at all. I didn't feel too bad as that was on Blitz Rope, who, frankly, had been indulging in criminal behaviour throughout the entire race. Let's have a look at some of this for which you get no penalty now. I think he aims for me there, which will be help slow him up. He then does the classic move on this corner of putting his nose in, leaving it in, pushing someone wide. We'll see that again in a minute. This is particularly dark. Puts his nose in, tries to spin him round, gets him all out of shape doesn't actually quite manage to get past. Same two here. Taps there. Drives into the back of him. Puts his car into the side of him there. Keeps his foot in, tries to drive him off the road. No penalties. Here's the move I was mentioning. Put it down the inside. Doesn't actually work for him. So you might get the impression from this that I'm not, <laughs> accelerates into the back of him there. I, I don't think this works. Might work if everyone's on board and you're all exceedingly good drivers. At this level, it doesn't. This is how H.H. H. Goldie gets from sixth to first. Uh, kept his foot in, pushing people wide there. Taps me here, quite a helpful one to be honest taps me again here he just knocks me out of the way really punt and drive past so in this particular lobby this just did not work at all um, maybe it's a bad combination maybe it will work better It's turned it into an arcade style game. Nothing like a sim at all, really. Unless you happen to be in a lobby where everybody, everybody's trying to do it right. So feel free to comment. What do you think, good or bad? If you like the content, give it a like.